good day, Hot Wheels peeps. It is Monday. Um, sorry, my wrestling's on. The kids just went to bed. I'm trying to do a video real quick because I really want to open up this box. Um, just finished eBay. A lot of snowflake cards went on eBay today. That's what I'm going to talk about. Um, went to a Target this morning. Some, uh, someone was coming out. He showed me a snowflake card. So I knew, and I heard that they were hitting, but I didn't know it was in a case, actual 72 count case. I thought it was another shipper because that's what I was told. Went to another store and scanned the card at Target. It popped up. There was a case in the back. I asked the guy. He went back there, grabbed the whole case. It had been opened up. However, all the cars were still in it. Wasn't no cars missing, and I thought, oh, crap. It had been opened up. All the good cars was gone, but they wasn't. So I took what I wanted, which was about 36, I think, cars. So about half. I took about half of it. It hung up the other half. And this is just a few of them. The rest of them are already on eBay. These are the ones that I was keeping. The Nova that I'd been looking for. I kept it. The Ford GT, the Golf Racing. I wasn't going to keep this. But once I got it, started looking at it. I actually started liking it. I usually don't keep the Ford GTs. But this one, something about the blue. I think it's the Golf Racing. I kept it. Um, the Toyota Supra. This was the only one. This one is on eBay. And all of mine, I started them out at like two fifty, three bucks a piece, because to me they're not worth more than that. If they jump, that's not on me. That's on the other people. And by the time you take the thirty cents out for the fees or whatever, and then they get the other other thing, I'm really only making about seventy five cents. So maybe a dollar twenty five at the most, at the minimum, because of the shipping, maybe. So. That's not too terribly bad. Like some people have them six, eight, ten bucks plus six dollars shipping. They're, they're making, and if people bid on them, they're making eight, nine dollars. So, but this one's on there. I know there's a few people that have asked me about this today. I'm going to see what it'll do on eBay. I seen this and I said, oh, another Batman car. However, I didn't notice it until I got home. That this is not the Batman vs. Superman car. This is the next Batman car. It says Batman Arkham Knight. And it's the Batman Arkham Knight. With the new wheel variation that they've been sticking on the trucks. So I thought, huh. So it's not the one I thought it was. Then there was... The Back Tree of the Future Time Machine. I know somebody's supposed to be sending me one of these. So when he does, one of them will, this one will probably be up for trade or something maybe. Or I may give it to my son because he... I sent pictures to my oldest this evening and he said, Oh, look, a Back to the Future. He's, he doesn't understand the snowflake cards. He thinks they're stupid. So, I don't know. He's a kid. Um, I've mentioned this before, and I got the Dodge Ram. That's the new wheels that's also on the Arkham. They're just actually a little bit smaller on the Arkham. And I'm really, to me, these look like truck wheels. But there's the Dodge. They didn't put the cover over the back like they used to. It's on a snowflake card. I'm really digging this yellow truck with the black stripe. I'm going to start displaying these also. However, this one won't be opened. I'll wait until C case comes out because this is a C case item. And I'll just get the mainline one and rip it open. And then there was this one, the Fair Lady Z. There was two of them. It's for the from the Need for Speed. One went on eBay before I finished. Someone already bid on it. It's already up to five bucks. And then the same person, I had two of these. And I have two of these coming in a trade. Last night, I talked to somebody. 
and I had two of them come in and a trade for something. I said, well, I won't have to worry about these. And then today I found two of them. So I threw one of them. And the two of the guys getting their little creased. And I'm like, I don't care. You know, like I've mentioned before, you know, as long as it's not terribly bad. And I've seen them and they're like, oh, it's just from the box where they were bent a little bit, you know. But there was two of these. So I threw one of these on eBay also. The Porsche, which I'm really digging. I am really liking this. I thought I was going to like this. I kept one, but because I was really hoping to see it. And once I got it, the blue, it, I wasn't as thrilled. This one, I like. And I'm not big into collecting Porsches. But for some reason, this one just really, I really, really like it. Same person who bid on the Fair Lady has also bid on this one. It's already up to five bucks. And then... Because I thought people went through the box, and lo and behold, if I didn't find it. The regular Treasure Hunt C case on a Snowflake card with the glow wheels. And yes, the wheels glow because I took pictures and the wheels actually glow. So that's the C case regular Treasure Hunt. It's obvious because the logo is right in the middle. You can't miss it. So then I went to a few other targets and they had looked like they'd already been gone through or didn't have them in the back. Went to a Walmart. They had a box of Matchbox cars on the floor. Grabbed another Cadillac. I just talked to someone this evening who was going to go get me two more. So when I get one of his or maybe the one that has the sticker on the back from the Hobby Town or whatever, I'll probably rip it open because I want to do a custom on one. So it'll probably get ripped open and this one will be the one I keep since I know this one came straight out of the box and there's no creases in it. And then I found a couple of these. Everybody's saying it's the Obama car because it's the president car. <laughs> but I grabbed a couple of these. I'm going to open up one probably next week or something. I may do it on here. I'm not doing it today because I have too much stuff opened up and scattered. I need to organize and figure out exactly how I'm going to do it but if I find another one I'm going to cut it and extend it and make it a super stretched maybe see if I can find some little flags or something and customize one of these take them ugly looking wheels off of it and now we'll get to the box I did a trade for this box let me show you guys what I traded hold on I'll be back in 10 seconds intermission break intermission break Okay, I'm back. What was that like a minute? Sorry, I got sidetracked. Wife was telling me what was going on with the wrestling thing. Anyway, I traded for a guy contacted me through I think YouTube. I mean, he's seen a pic. He watched the video. He doesn't do YouTube, but he watches them. And he contacted me through an email, asking me what I was going to do with this. I found another one, but I hadn't, I didn't show it because there was no reason in it. This one was a little dinged up. That had the chase car, remember? He wanted it and said, I have something that you want. He said, it's a Silverado. And I said, really? So he sent me a picture. He sent me a picture and I didn't even have enough time to say sold. That's how bad I was like ugh, trying to type it real fast. He kind of put it in here kind of crooked. He told me he, oh, I guess he did. He said he thought he had an extra protector pack to put it in. He wasn't for sure. He said, I don't think you keep those kind of protector packs, but I told him he needs to go in one anyway. I have a protector pack. I'll put it in. 
Holy moly, he takes it pretty good. PJ already knows what this is because he asked me today. <laughs> I've been talking to him all day. So he already knew because he showed me a picture of something he got today, which is freaking awesome. But that's okay. I was needing this. I appreciate this whole bunch. I'm ecstatic. I'm not even going to show it to you, the protector pack. I'm taking it out of the protector pack. So this is one of them El Cheapos. This don't even have a name on it. I'll use it for something else. Ooh, he didn't tell me that. Crap. I can fix it, though. It looks like it's starting to come apart. Right there. I can fix that. I have a brush that fits the glue down in there. Because I'm going to have to do that before I put it in the... I'm going to do that as soon as this video is over before I even download it. Put it in the right protector pack. Because there's no creases in this card. At all. Just that. He didn't tell me about that Nina. But oh well. I got one. I'm trying to be careful with it so it don't come all the way off. Finally got it. There's my Silverado. The 83 Silverado in the Modern Classics. All I need now is the green 92 Ford Mustang. And I'll have every one in every color. That thing is freaking sharp. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. <laughs> There's the front. They need to do that Chevrolet emblem on all of them. And not just the black grill. There's the truck. I'm ecstatic. I finally got it. <sighs> okay. With that being said, that's gonna sit right there because I'm gonna I'm gonna go get the glue and bring it in here. <laughs> Close that back up. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Sorry it's kind of short, but I got to get back to the wrestling. Um, other than that, I hope you guys have a good evening. Oh, uh, plus she's doing boxes also. Dust in your box will go out tomorrow. It's being packaged as we speak. Um, or as you watch the video, if you watch it tonight, if not, it your box will be going out. Um, with that being said, I hope you guys have a good evening and bye-bye.